Hey, hey, Eric, can I interrupt? There's just been a couple of yes. questions that have popped up. Um, someone had asked, okay. this seems to be um, automatic translations fine in English. Um, it doesn't have masculine or feminine nouns, um, the effect, the adjectives and verbs. What happens, for example, in French? So can we address that if possible? Yeah, sure. Now, of course, I'm, I'm translating from, from a, a, a multiple gender language to a single gender language, so I've got it really e easy. But uh, obviously, uh, if you're if you're working in, in French, I'm just going to kill this uh, automatic suggestion mode here, uh, and we'll take a look just in the same uh, in the same database. Um, I, I'm afraid I, I don't know all that much French, but I think it's uh, le chat or something like that. Um, Okay, that works fine, but what if it's, uh, can somebody give me a, a French word that's got another, uh, oh, isn't it, isn't it, the table, huh, right, the table, uh, that's going to be, okay, la, I, I hope I'm getting this right, guys, it's been a long time since I've done any French, la table, um, so now, I'm just undoing this in Microsoft Word so we can go back to the same sentence again, now what you can see is I've got two choices, for uh, my articles, uh, le and la, and uh, there, what you what you will find that's uh, that's actually quite useful is uh, not necessarily for the individual words, but uh, when when you see the the phrases together, you notice that Snowball's remembering the article together with the word, and you saw previously also. I translated one word, uh, sitzt in German, as two words in English, is sitting. There's a lot of freedom uh, of going back and forth here, uh, making longer segments out of shorter ones, making shorter segments out of longer ones. Snowball recognizes the table as la table, and it recognizes the cat as le chat. So uh, y y is that right? Or is it La Chat? I, I, I can't think even correct. remember, but you, but you get my point anyway. Uh, that as as long as, as Snowball sees the articles together with the words, it's not going to be a problem. Otherwise, obviously, uh, you're the human operator. You're the one who actually knows what's really going on here, and you may have to hit an arrow key or two to get to Le or La. And if it's the, if that's too slow for you, uh, then uh, you just uh, Type it in as you as you would normally anyway. And, and, it's, and uh, it sounds like the environment learns to, to a degree which articles are used with which nouns and and. Yeah, yeah, that's that's right. It will. Uh, I I I hate to say it learns, because we've got a really really simple simple tool here. But the the effect of the way it works is that yes, it's it's really learning what you're doing, and it's remembering it for for the future. That's great. Uh, just a couple other here. There was one uh, sort of unsolicited testimonial that this is amazing. We'll never use the translation environment again. Uh, that was from Dharma. Thank you. 